put in British countryside. Kids playing, shopkeeper is busy. But what's this? It's it is us, the sadistic goose from the other side of the lake who loves to wreak havoc at the local precincts. <laughs> oh boy, do I have some nasty ones planned for the game. <laughs> Okay, hang on, we wait for the boy to come back because we have to get him in the phone booth. Oh, that's what I might have to do as well. I got the. <laughs> so, yeah, I get to get the boy in the phone booth, get on TV, and go and do some shopping. Guess what? We'll wait for the boy to come back. We can try getting started. We have to deal with men in a minute, boy. I just had to do some shopping. Place where the shopkeeper will find find my groceries when I get them. Yeah, this looks like a decent enough spot. Uh, just uh, hang on. Uh, no, that's an apple core. I don't want apple cores. Move that bed. Drop this in. There we go. We have our, we have our first item. Now we need to, to get some, some tin food, a cleaner, a hairbrush, and some fruits and veggies. Or well, just any fruit or veggie will do. And we make our way back over. Oh, hi. Okay, you do that. You get your nail gun. I'm gonna just get myself some TP. Or well, as it's listed in game. Loo cleaner, since this is supposed to be the British countryside, the toilet or the bathroom is referred to as the loo. So, yeah, it's loo cleaner. So, you, we don't put the loo cleaner in the basket yet because it's really big and takes a lot of. Also, in the meantime, we can get back to the boy. So, hello again. Oop, no, no, don't go in there, I'm here, so... Yeah, get in there. <laughs> okay, so I'll just go to the boy for help. Just need to help the boy. And we can get in. Sneak it! Finish my shopping first, so let's see where okay, shopkeepers it's off elsewhere, so perfect time to grab some groceries. Oops, I uh, dropped it. Just pick it up. No, she's but uh, how did she see me? Can I move this thing? 
Can't do some trolling. <laughs> I want to get rid of this sign. Because in the garden, we could get rid of the knock down the grass keeper's sign. And, I mean, the groundskeeper's sign. That's we got him to crush his thumb. Okay, well, she's distracted. So. <laughs> Nothing, boy. Okay, leave me alone, or I'll hunk you back into the full booth. Grocery shopping. Okay, cleaner. Hmm. Exactly twelve qualifies as clean. Oh, it's probably probably those things over there. Probably this one. This cleaner. Wait, no, that's not. That's just an empty bottle. Wait, hang on. I thought that my beak was in the bottle, so I'm gonna just pick this thing up again. Hang on, pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually muffled. Ah, oh, that's clever game. This, this, this nice aesthetic. Now, let's see if this counts as cleaner. Eh. You can get with the lighting to go in. Go in the basket, damn it! You're supposed to. Go get in the basket. Okay, that counts. Now we get ourselves some. It's one of the fruits and veggies, and, and then the toilet paper in it. Put the toilet paper in, and we're done cleaning. Oop. Can't let. We're catching the shopkeeper's attention. Or actually, no, we will need to catch your attention. It's a distraction. Got shopping. Now we can try to trap her in the garage. Hmm. Ah, now it's open. <laughs> honk honk. You didn't chase me to shop. So. <laughs> around April Fool's Day is every day of the year. In fact, every day is Fool's Day of some kind. 
be it January Fool's Day, February Fool's Day, March Fool's Day, whatever. I'm just, just not being goose, the sadistic goose. Paper, and then we take the second slipper. Yes. Gotta make him go barefoot. Oh. <laughs> Not for a second, they broke him. Why are you looking at his paper? Stop looking at him. You're supposed to catch a slipper. Damn yeah, goose. What am I supposed to do to get the slipper off of him? It's because for some reason the goose feels compelled to look at the man. <sighs> Again, it's not easy being a goose. Okay. <sighs> I'm gonna just go off. Ribbon off. Ah. Do, 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 do. Oh, great.
egg hidden on the bust. Great, I think she knows where I hit the statue. Damn it! very much are too different like, like the man is very very tidy while the lady is very messy and if the man spots anything that doesn't wasn't part of his garden he just tosses it over the fence so so if i gave that toss that face it'll break but yeah, it's all about time she can say not how observant these guys tend to be Take one of his slippers. Like, Damn it, he removes the soap. I mean,
Oops. his tea, but he hasn't even tried to sip tea, so maybe I have to do something with the, with the pot or with the cup and try, maybe try to fill it with tea, but, but how? Hmm. <laughs> Why well, he doesn't even bother? <laughs> oh, 
Let's do them. Take his other slipper. And steal slippers. Trying to see maybe if she can fix the vase or something, or is he just keeping the broken pieces as a memoir? Yes. And this is actually where I'm gonna end this episode, guys, because I'm having a bit of issue like uh, doing the other pranks, like I can take away the man's other slipper and taking man's other slipper and making him spit out his tea, because for some reason he doesn't bother trying to drink tea, he's just reading his newspaper. Maybe if I somehow take get rid of the newspaper without him knowing, then he'll try to sip tea, I don't know. And then just get all the things for the washing. I'll do those next time. But in the meantime, we finished up the shop, and we, we, made, we made the break of base, made our bust, and I replaced the statue as for myself, with the statue with myself, so I can get that nice ribbon and look spiffy. In the meantime, that, that, so next time you can get, expect to see more goose pranks than anything. Anyway, that's it for now. So, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you all next time. Farewell.